Welcome, in this video I'll show you how to fix Adobe Photoshop if it's not opening on Windows 11. Alright, if you find this video helpful, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more such tutorials. Now first up, you gotta find Adobe Photoshop right here in your search bar. Just type down Photoshop, okay? Right click on it and click on open file location. Now once done, you gotta find the app right here, right click on it and click on properties, okay? Once done, you gotta find compatibility tab. Click on it and make sure that disable full screen optimizations and run this program as administrator is ticked. Once done, just hit on apply, hit on OK. Double click on Photoshop right here and check if it helps. Now, if that's your work, go ahead over to your uh, drive C or where Photoshop is installed. But by default, it is installed on C and program files. Adobe right here. Find Photoshop. Double click and find plugins. Okay. Double click on plugins and if you have multiple plugins right here, just press Ctrl plus A, then delete all. You can just go ahead and install them later. Okay, delete all and once done, open up Photoshop and it should work now. Okay, if that's the work, go ahead over to your search bar and type down Windows Defender. All right, now got to click on Windows Defender Firewall. Click on it and click on Allow an App or Feature through Windows Defender Firewall. Click. Now in here, if you can find uh, Photoshop, okay. All right, if you can find it, just basically uh, tick both private and public. And once done, you should be good to go. Now, if you can't find it, just like uh, what I have in here, or I don't have it in here, just basically click on change settings, allow an app, click on browse. Now let's go out and find drive C, program files, Adobe, Photoshop, scroll down and find Photoshop, click on it, hit on open, hit on add, now again, Adobe Photoshop right here, make sure private and public are both ticked. Head on OK, close this one, restart your computer, and after that, launch Adobe Photoshop, and everything should work perfectly fine now. And that is it. Well, I hope this video helps, and I'll see you in the next one.